As hospital beds fill up, concern over staffing levels is growing. We're already getting creative and recognizing that we are um, feeling the pinch, if you will. Dr. David Wild uh, says uh, one factor staffing impacting staffing question. at the University of Kansas Health System is employees contracting COVID-19 outside of work. It's been approaching 100. The health system is able to handle current patients, but as cases increase, they're ready to tap clinical staff working in administrative roles. We've begun to bring those people back into patient care at a higher rate than, than we would normally as a way to help bolster the pool. They're also reaching out to staff who have retired or changed careers. We've asked them if they would be willing to come back and work to begin to have another pool of people to pull from. At Truman Medical Center, Chief Medical Officer Dr. Mark Steele says if the hospital is overwhelmed, we may be forced to reduce again some of our elective surgeries and some of our clinic cases and pull some of that staff into our inpatient setting. Right now, they are meeting patient needs. But obviously, if we continue to see increases in hospitalizations related to COVID, that could certainly put us under some stress.